Welcome everybody to episode 6 of Azariah's ModCraft Adventure. I was a little frustrated at the end of the last episode. Um, oh, where you saw me utilize my branch mine to get frickin' coal, and it was a pain in the ass. Um, I'm gonna make this thing learn coal. I could have sworn I had coal already learned. In fact, I did, I did have coal already learned. Hmm, interesting. I let it learn stone. Okay, good. Now, we are making our alchemical chest. Booyah. Okay. Alchemical chest. Love these things. Um, I do need a condenser, which is one alchemical chest, four diamonds, and four obsidian. Okay. I don't have four. Oh, I do have four obsidian. Okay. One alchemical chest, four obsidian, and four diamond. Energy condenser. Okay. The reason why I wanted the energy condenser, and we're going to go ahead and let this thing learn that, I think, yeah, it's worth a lot of energy, is because... Yeah, here we go. Glowstone block. It's got to learn that, too. <laughs> Equivalent exchange can be construed as very tedious. There we go. But... Okay, what the energy condenser does is it gathers up all of the energy that's around it, and it goes to craft whatever object is sitting inside of it. For example, we're using... Now, right now, that's not going to do anything, but... Let's see, we're going to need a, an energy collector, which is this one, Mach 1, which is going to be 6, a dark ma- ooh, how do you make dark matter? A block of diamond and 8 eternalist fuel. So we need, oh, Jesus, and a bit of glass, but we've got glass. Oh, wait a minute. I can make it this way. Energy collector. Okay, block a diamond of furnace. Okay, we can do that. Okay, we've got block a diamond. We need a furnace. So, let's throw some stone in there. And get the Klein Star. I made one too many. Here, I'll just burn that back out. There we go. Okay. We need a furnace. I believe it was, yes. Bit of... Maybe a little bit more glowstone. Energy collector. There we go. I'm going to drop off one or two things out of my inventory that we're not using in the immediate moment, like this glass, those, um, sand. And I don't think we need these dusts for right yet. Okay. I think we're good to go for a minute. Now you take your energy collector. And this is a Mach 1 energy collector, so it's not worth very much. Now, if we wanted to, to upgrade it to a Mach 2, that's going to take this, these, and then the dark mat. Okay, see, I know what I did wrong. All right. And what this is going to do, we'll put this next to it, on top of it, rather, is this is going to start gathering energy. You put a piece of whatever you want to have in here, and what it's going to do is it's going to upgrade it very, very slowly. Climb star back out here. I think I can collect this energy back up. Yes. No, wait a minute. Ah! <laughs> no! <laughs> That'll be right. But, as this is gathering energy, it's filling energy into the energy co co uh, condenser, and that's, um, yeah. 
Okay. Wait a minute. What? Energy collector. Well, what was... Oh, the relay. Mm. Antimatter relay. Is one dark matter an anti... Antimatter relay is another block of obsidian, er, yeah, six, seven blocks of obsidian, glowstone, and diamond. I don't think I have that much obsidian. Yeah, I need seven. Okay. Alright, good job. Oh, man, I need more diamond. I don't have enough energy to make diamond, do I? Hmm. Well, let's burn something up. Four. Okay, we have our nine diamonds. Seven glowstone. We're... Oh, good God, that scared me. Still fully charged, yes. Okay, good. And we need our bit of glass. And I'm also going to make something else, too, while I was thinking about it. I need four of these extra. And twenty-four iron. I think that's enough. Okay. Antimatter relay. Now, what the antimatter relay is going to do, and we're going to put that here next to the collector, and we'll put this next to it. The reason for the glowstone is because it um, enables more energy to be. Um, of course, that couldn't be four. Yes. See that this thing's filling up. That's drawing energy directly into the Klein star. Now, if we take the Klein star out. See, the problem with this, this thing is, though, is that while this is charging up now, see, it's going faster because I've got all this shit next to it. it. Stops putting energy into the condenser. That's the only drawback. Anyway, moving on. Get some daylight. <coughs> anyway, that's how that shit works. This is the correct configuration that I found um, works perfectly. Whoops. Um, we're going to throw the Klein Star in here. Let it charge up. Uh, you can also put stuff in here to burn it up. See, so watch. Shame, 
mindlessly doing that because I can always go back to the nether. <laughs> Alright. I'm also going to burn that up too. We don't need that. Not today or anyway. Okay. Now, the other thing that I wanted to make... <sighs> yeah, here we go. Longfall boot. Two of them. And what you do is you put two side by side. And now you have longfall boots. Now, what longfall boots does... There. <clears throat> I am less armored. It does not protect you at all. Um, unfortunately. However, let's put this in the clan star here. Boots. I just wanted that extra little bit of energy in my clan star. Oh, you can also stick stuff in here to be destroyed, too. Not that, obviously. I'm not, not killing off blaze rods just yet. Um, and the more you upgrade these things, these these two devices, the faster this thing runs. So what you do is you just keep feeding shit in here that you don't need, like cobble and gravel and stuff like that. Um, huh. Oh, I was just seeing how much... Okay. Anyway, here's what long fall boots do. Well, this is one of my favorite items in the entire game. See that? No damage at all. <laughs> is it a cheat? Possibly. Do I care? Hell no! I need an ender pearl. Because the other thing that I wanted to make was... Basic portal gun. Oh, I need a diamond too. Hmm. I need one diamond, two, three, four, five iron, two obsidian, and an ender pearl. And I think I ate up my ender pearls, didn't I? Well, it'll be okay. The machine knows how to make it now, so yeah, it'll be a whole lot easier. I want to take and burn some stuff up that I'm not currently using, like this shit here. Nicolite does not have a use um, yet. Burn up some of this stuff too. And yeah, red is one we don't actually need it right away. Yeah, screw another rack. Um, what else am I currently not using? That's good. Anything in here? Not yet. Okay. Heading up. I don't think I can burn nickelite. <laughs> I just realized it. This is just going to be like a derping episode, um, because I'm not coordinated right now. We're, I'm going to make a trip into the nether, um, I think, with a shit ton of cobble, and I'm going to make a safe... Actually, what I want to do is make the portal gun. So we're going to have that made. See, it's too bad you can't type into the transmutation table what item it is you want. I'm just hoping I can come up with one ender pearl. Let's get the Klein Star out. Ender Pearl. Sweet! Okay. And we need a bit of obsidian. Ah, here we go. Was it two I needed? Alright. Let's see. It knows how to make redstone already. Redstone's not worth anything. Wow. Nicolite is, though. And we're gonna need a diamond. There we go. That should be enough. Now let's get the con correct configuration again here. What? No, I want to make the gun, idiot. Err. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Um, was it diamond here, ender pearl there? Yay, portal gun! This is probably one of the coolest devices in the entire game, and it's going to lag these shit out of me. No open portals. Okay, good deal. And like I said, the reason, um, the only reason really that I wanted to have the portal gun with me 
is so that when I get to back to the nether, um, I'm going to be moving the blaze spawner to an area that I designate as safe and um, have like a trap. There we go, that's fine. Yeah, I don't care about the wood. What I do care about... Oh. Yeah, gravel becomes sandstone. <laughs> With the fillstone. Alright, that's good enough. Okay. There we go. That's fine. Alright. Oh, I don't have my button. Oh, no. I can't get back in my house. Oh, that's gay. Alright. Did I burn up all that coal, or do I have any left? I have one piece of stone left. Well, I'm not going to waste a blaze rod on it. Here, let's make um, let's make the, the transmog table here. Uh, what can I throw in here? What? What are you doing to me? Forgot what order I have to do this shit in here. There we go. Just want one piece of frickin' stone. That's all I want. Okay. Just to make a button. That damn creeper destroyed. Okay. Now, when I come back... Let's see. It's 12.09 now. And we got 17 minutes on this episode. I'm actually... Hmm. I'm confuzzled. With what I wanted to have done here. Does, does it know redstone? Yeah, it knows redstone. Alright, let's just throw this shit in here. Oh, it doesn't need another rack. Oops, that's my alarm clock. Sorry about that, everybody. I woke up really early this morning. <laughs> Way earlier than I ever would have needed to. Oh, wait a minute. That threw away with the only sword I had here. Hold on a second. Toss that in. Uh, what else was it that I wanted to throw out? Uh, let's get our Kleiny back here. Yeah. See, this is getting full up. How do we make a destruction catalyst here? Nova catalyst, which is a TNT charge and a Mobius fuel. We'll make two of these. Um, flint and steel. We know how to make Mobius fuel. We can't really... We can, but we don't have the, the resources just yet. I need a lot more coal. And... Now it's not looking like coal wants to show up. Hmm. None of those are coal. Ah, here we go, coal. Yeah, it's fine. Why 
Why did I just do that? Well, that's okay. There's really no energy lost. Yeah, here we go. Heh, <laughs> 31 blaze rods. Yeah, there's no energy lost. Okay, I'll be right back, folks. Sorry, I'm back. <laughs> A little call of nature there. Okay, now, the next thing we're going to do... Um, I'm going to make two things. I guess my armor's fine. It's not a whole lot of cobble I have left. We're going to put some more stuff away. No, not that way. Uh, let's see, I want to get my bow out. I need this arrow. I'm going to throw this shit in there. These, a couple of torches. Um, take the bread, leave the apples. Uh, we don't need the axe. And we're not going to need a clock, because we're going into the nether. Um, I'm going to go ahead and build that blaze trap on camera here. Um, I don't need this gravel. There we go. And it learns it when you when you toss it in there, too. I didn't know if you guys noticed that or not. Got a couple of stacks of this stuff here. And... I do believe I still have my, um... I hear a spider and it's pissing me off. Oh well. I do believe I still have my chest in the nether. So I can go ahead and drop some stuff off. Oh, I know what I wanted. Ah, I grabbed the bow, but I didn't grab any ammo. <laughs> I feel stupid now. Alright, the ammo's gonna be expensive. Uh, let's put this in the... Yeah, we're not gonna need a shovel in the nether. Uh, yeah. There we go. Grab two stacks of arrows. There, now we've got enough. Now, I know nothing's enchanted. I don't have an enchanting table yet. Um, I'm getting irritated by the fact that I don't have an enchanting table yet. Um, but it's okay. Like I said, we're only level 4 anyway, so it's not like we have enough experience to spend on enchantments just yet. Um, I know this is going rather slowly, you know, compared to, to most Let's Plays. But, uh, like, I just want to try to get stuff done as safely as humanly possible. Okay, that damn ghast is still there. Your ass is to bully. Ow. Well, me and this ghast are going to have some problems. Ow. Gotcha. Did you drop your pearl? Not pearl, but ghast here. Damn, he didn't. Ah, I was really hoping for a ghast here off of him. Oh, well. Yeah, I'm actually not going to do a tunnel um, leading to where... Ow. Leading to where that um, blaze trap is, blaze spawner rather. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to stand here rather, and I'm going to build a blaze farm right here. And I'll tell you why. Oh, here's another cool thing you can do too. Watch this. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know if anyone knew about that or not. Okay. Flatten this up. I want it two wide. Four wide. Except right here. Yeah, that'll make a nice little killy spot. Yeah, I'll tell you what, while I'm getting another rack instead of... There. Now, what it, eventually what I'm going to do is I'm going to make pistons and have it be to where it'll um, damage them slightly so I'm not killing my weapons off. But, um... It'll be okay for now. Like I said, I just want it closer to me. Make 
this is safe as houses. I don't want my blazes escaping either. Um, gosh, the lag in here is crazy! Let me see if I can do something about this lag. Clouds off. Fog. Details animations. Lava animation off. I think I just froze the game up. <laughs> no, not dynamic. Like that. <laughs> there we go. Lava animated off. There. That should help out with the lag a little bit. Okay. Yeah, see, this makes a nice little killy spot. Okay. And it doesn't have to be really fancy. I don't really want it fancy at all, honestly. Yeah, that looks good. And I'm not sure what the limited range on the, you know, like, like do I have to put a shelf on it? Like, this is, I've never really made a, um, a trap quite like this one before. So I'm just trying to think, um, what size I need it and stuff like that. I kind of want to put it directly above. But see, I also don't want it to be... Like, I don't want the blazes to be up here and then not spawning outside, you know? I mean, I don't want the blazes, rather, to be spawning outside the killy zone. I'd rather them spawn right inside of there where I can, you know, do something about it. lock this in place. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I want this to open. And the reason why I want to open is because when I use the portal gun, which is going to really, really lag, um, any open portal will lag. <sighs> Freaking hate the nether. This game ran so perfectly on the other laptop. Let's just close that off. There we go. Um. No, here we go. I want that there. That there. Okay, good. Sounds like he's going, help me. <laughs> um, see, I wanted it too wide. Okay. And we're going to go three high, so we're going to go one more. I need, um, nether wart, too. I gotta find... Hopefully I can find some. Oops. There. And we're gonna put it... The spawner. We're gonna stick it right... Alright, there we go. Now we gotta get back up. This is going to be very perilous, by the way. <laughs> yeah, see, we're going to stick the spawner right here, if we can. And uh, here's what I'm going to be doing, by the way. Um, you're going to see it, too. So you can move blocks around. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to where that blaze spawner was. Yoink it. And then, um... Put it right there, and then walk, you know, come 
quickly come back down and then re relock it off. And then that way it'll put the blaze spawner right next to the portal. That way I ain't got to walk all the way out there. But one time. Okay. Oh, you know what I need to do? I gotta put the portal down. Gosh, the lag is really killing me. Is that up? Okay, that's up. Alright. Alright, time to run to where the spawner is. Now, let's keep this pigman from getting inside. See, the problem is the damn lava. Wait a minute, I think the spawner was this way. If I remember correctly. Yeah, I think it's this way. Um, the other thing we're going to build, um, probably I'm going to start it on the next episode, is a uh, shaft leading down to the main base, uh, from the main base, rather, to the to the branch mine. Ah, here, yeah, this is the way. Um, and then from there, I'm going to go grab that spider spawner, and I'm going to show you guys how to make an automatic um, a string collector. And since we don't need string now that we already have a bow... I'm going to set it up to where it'll be disposed of. Alright, we got to go... Which way was it? This way. And then once we get this uh, blaze spawner taken care of... That thing changed color, didn't it? When I first created it, it was blue. Alright. Like I said, this is going to be very, very... Not really difficult, but... Yeah, yeah, kind of. It's, it's going to be difficult. It's going to be insanity. Alright. See, i got to get close enough to the spawner. See, it's already starting. Ow. See, that's the problem. Is deactivating this stupid thing. And then all my armor's down there, too. And I have no potions. What a pain in the ass. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna pause it right here and I'll resume in the nether. Okay, back in the nether. It's probably gonna end up kicking my ass again. Oh, why... Oh no, I can't go in the portal. What's blocking me? <sighs> Did I at least get anything? I got my armor. <sighs> Damn. Alright, I gotta get back down there before that shit despawns. The fall's gonna kill me too. There's nothing to it but to do it. <sighs> My shit's gonna despawn. I don't know what's in front of the portal that's keeping me from going in there. Hopefully I can get there before everything I had despawns. What a pain in my ass. I 
I just wish the Nether wasn't so freaking laggy. I mean, they added all this stuff to it, and all these open vistas, and this damn lava is what does it. It's ridiculous. And now that that spawner is out of its trap, this is going to be very perilous. Alright, hang on a second. Okay, there we go. I stuck it on easy. <laughs> That'll help me out a little bit, because this is ridiculous. Right, there's my portal gun. Okay. Okay, I got it. Whew. Yeah, I stuck it on easy so that it, um... There we go. There. Oh. There. Already. Okay. Whew, that was ridiculous. <laughs> Alright, let's get our gear back on here. And we'll get our fresh sword. And our bow, pickaxe, and stuff like that. Alright, now that we can put that back on normal. I don't know, I'm down here. <laughs> Children! Oh, okay. The portal gun changed color on my screen when I, uh, when I activated a portal. It's never done that before. Strange. There we go. Uh, I gotta at least make a, um... Retrieval system. Okay, but there it is. It works. It's just really loud. Um, alright. Now that I'm thinking about it. I guess we didn't eat any of that cobble. Um, bread. Soul sand. Okay, we don't need that right yet. Blaze rod. Okay, what I'm gonna do is whoops, need the portal gun. There. Drop a portal down. And I'm gonna go look for another wart. And when we find it, hopefully we'll find some. I got also gotta pick up a little bit of soul oh shit. This guy's out of my freaking way. <gasps> is that a... Why is that gunpowder? And not gas tier. Damn it. I was hoping for another a gas tier. Gas tier is really hard to, to, to come across because... You know, they have such a large patrol zone. God, look at all these damn go uh, zombie pigmen. Let's go around the lava. Anyway, yeah, gas tears make um, a splash potion of health. Pick up a little bit of clothes.
just stone while I'm standing here. I apologize for this lag, everybody. It's the, it's the damn nether. I don't understand it, you know. Uh, I need nether wart. Uh, the reason for the portal gun, too, is it so that when I find it, I have a fast track back to the, the nether base. Coming up on 40 minutes again. Honestly, I didn't. I don't really want my videos to be this long, but... Oh, my God. Let's see. Can we go over this one? Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm nervous of that. I don't want that going on. And I'll tell you what. I'm gonna carve us a little. You're gasty. Okay, good. Whew. A little tunnel over the lava there. <laughs> See, the problem is I don't want the view distance this far. And unfortunately, with the um, Optifine quality, mip map, clear water, better grass, custom fonts, smooth biomes, graphics fast, this fog details. We're stuck with whatever. I guess that's what the the what, with Optifine it allows you to have the maximum view distance while still not being laggy as holy hell. Now, see, I would use the portal gun to get down there, which is probably its intended use. <laughs> but I wanted to, to get back to the main base because right now I'm kind of lost. Ooh, that is a lot of lava. Wow. Oh, that's yo. Ooh. What's funny is that all that lava that's down... Oh, God. That's down there. Is all coming off of two s lava sources. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to work either. Alright, I tell you what. I want to go in a different direction. Right, we're going to end the video now. I, this has gotten to be, to be a little bit too long. And I know that there are complaints where my videos are too long. So anyway, um, yeah, we got our blaze farm. So, happy about that. Um, next next episode, uh, I'm going to stand at this blaze farm for a while. Next episode, hopefully, we'll be able to um, pick up some nether wart to make potions with. And you guys have been a great audience, and we'll catch you on the next episode. Bye!